All right, good morning. We're live on the trail. Look right, look left. Here we are going peace sign all around. And a slow blink with the right in the trail. Cause it's so good to be alive right now over there. Yeah, looking out across the river. With the breezy shirt looking ahead. Hey, who's that? Oh, that's YouTube. Okay. Riding into work is so slow today. So, moving the hand all around. Excited to be alive. It's a beautiful day. All the regular morning sayings we can think of. And here we go, slow five mile an hour car in the background, and looking up, blinking slow, feeling the power of the pedals, shifting the eyes right, locking gauge, giving the push sign, turning the head, and slow jogger going by. No reaction time in three, two, one, nothing. Ouch! Killer! Sticking with the peace sign on the hand. We know how to count. Enjoying it. And this was originally going to be a story time Thursday, but it's taken so long just to do the morning intro that it, it's just a too much, you know? You know, I'm so... What am I saying? Oh, it's just... Yeah. Oh. Mm. Uh huh. Watch out. I I wanted to see, so this this segment is, is obviously slowed down a little bit, just a tiny bit, to um 240 frames a second. So it definitely slowed it down a couple times. Um, regardless, you know, it's it's quite interesting how everything just slows down. But what I was saying with story time Thursday is. Um, there was this time where I was reading this book about a guy who didn't talk for like 18 years and he didn't use a car. He walked everywhere. He didn't use a bike either. He walked everywhere. Um, I'll, I'll put a link down below. A uh, really cool guy. And so one day I was reading the book. I was driving. Mom, maybe you remember this. I was driving. We were in the car coming back from Safeway and, um, I told her about the guy and she's like, that's interesting. Would you ever do that? And then I never spoke again for the next 24 hours I didn't say anything and so I didn't use my voice and it was crazy because you know you're usually so used to reacting so it's something that a guy like me needs to do every once in a while just shut the heck up you know so I did it um Jeopardy was not as fun and and the next day when uh, my little brother and I went to In-N-Out um I happened to ran into like a co-worker and it was it was really awkward because I couldn't say anything um, because I was doing this thing and I had to tell him to, to explain to her that, you know, I'm, I'm doing this thing where I'm not talking for 24 hours and then that just leaves her confused and I can't explain the, the weirdness of